Hello and welcome back to another ADT 2007 wall cleanups lesson and this is uh, should be a quick lesson here we're talking about cleaning up walls between X refs so uh, in the past um, it did work it was a little bit buggy and if you copied and mirrored the plans around after you X ref them your cleanups would just not work so they've done a great job on improving it and I'll show you how it works so what I've done is I've got a couple of drawings I'm gonna go open them up I'm gonna go file I have two drawings called X ref 1 and X ref 2 so I'm gonna open up X ref 1 and all it is is a drawing that has three walls okay and I as I said in the in the very first of this tutorial set we're gonna go under format style manager architectural wall cleanup group definitions I'm gonna look at that one and I can right click and say new and make more and do whatever I want the main thing is the cleanup group definition is set to be allow wall cleanup between host and xrefs okay so as long as that's checked on and that is the cleanup group definition and if I click on the wall and I check the cleanup group definition and it is standard that's the first step that has to take place and these are all going to be the same okay now I'm going to say okay fine I can save that drawing and then I can use whatever means I want then I can go into my xref2 drawing same thing exactly click on here right click if I want go into edit the um, oh I sorry I want to go up into the style manager format style manager architectural wall cleanup group definitions here it is here now remember in your style manager you can right click and copy and anytime you want go in you know you can copy and paste styles from drawing to drawing right this and we can even go open and open up another drawing and opening it here is only opening it in the style manager it's not opening it like opening it in AutoCAD so I can go back into here once I get one of these the way I want and say copy and then go to my other drawing anytime and say paste and then overwrite the existing etc so you can start to get creative moving your styles around the main thing is this thing is all checked off and it's saved in both drawings okay and then I'm gonna in the drawing that I'm in right now which is just a blank drawing I'm even gonna check here style manager and clean up group definition here just to make sure same thing okay good now I type in xref and we get our new xref palette which is nice I go in here I right click and I say attach a drawing I can attach more than one at a time using my control button I can pick both of those and you can see their opposite sides and then my zero zero is predetermined and bring them in and maybe do a zoom extents and there's my xref2 my xref1 okay now in the and it's doing the cleanup in between here okay I can go back and reload these by going in here right click edit them maybe this isn't even my drawing maybe this is the unit plan I'm doing a key plan or something someone else is working on this drawing the main thing is I can bring them in and they're going to clean up now this is great for if we're doing unit plans for you know hospitals or schools or condos or apartments anything that we use unit plans in then I can take this and I can mirror that over if I want okay I can rotate this if I want you know 45 degrees okay and then maybe I can mirror it again over to here okay move it up doesn't matter my cleanup in the past versions of ADT your sorry your cleanup I only worked on the first two UX refed in ADT 2007 finally now uh, has made it so that both um, if you mirror copy rotate if you copy this around this X ref in this drawing your cleanups are still gonna work is the bottom line there now we can just go back in here and you know reload or detach or deal with these as we please so there's really nothing more to this lesson than that um, make sure your cleanup group definitions are set and then xref your drawings in and then just basically go on about your day and uh, they will do their cleanup just as if they were you know back in their own drawing so they still have you know the, all the priority rules and all the Z conditions all still apply here same rules the only difference is now it's cleaning up between xrefs
And one last point, actually, before we go, uh, just to kind of show some, some other aspects here. Um, what happens if I take this and move it? Okay. Uh, you'll see that the lines don't come back. Okay. There's a tool up here, View, Regen, Model. This is like an ADT regen. Pick on here and we'll get those lines back because doing R-E-G-E-N, Enter or Redraw isn't going to fix it. Actually, Regen looked like it, it fixed that. So now watch if I move it back again let's say I brought my X ref in in the wrong place and then I decide to move it after the fact okay I'll let's do RE for regen okay R E G E N okay it's not fixing it but watch if I go now to view regen model which I wish they would call ADT regen and then click on these two guys bang we get our line disappearing Okay, sometimes people, I, they say, you have to save and open your file again. Well, actually, you don't, but doing that is like kind of uh, killing it with a, with a sledgehammer. So, again, view, regen model is the ADT regen. So, we can use that once we take our objects and move them around. We can do regen. We can just hit enter, and it regens everything in the drawing. Okay, watch, view, regen model, instead of clicking and on something just hit an enter and it just does the whole drawing everything gets refreshed so there's another little tip for you and I think I had my mouse turned off on that last uh, little bit so just one more time here so I can you can see that view refresh enter and done